Hi! Today, I'm gonna show you a nice restaurant near the famous Korean Fort Village near Yongin, Korea. It's Don Pablo Mexican Bar and Grill, where you can have Mexican food. I also had delicious fresh strawberry solving snow ice as a dessert at Solving Cafe that is located in the same building. As the Mexican restaurant is near Korean Fort Village, I'll show you the entrance of Korean Fort Village first. In warm spring, after visiting Korean Fort Village in Hanbok, Korean traditional clothes, having Mexican food there would be nice. If you wear Hanbok, you get 12,000 won discount from the original fee of 28,000 won and just pay 16,000 won, which includes all free passes. When it gets warm, I'll go there in Hanbok and make a video. Now. If we go down the street from the entrance, the street is lined with shop. Hamburg rental shop is seen. If you drive down the street just for a minute, you can see a hotel and it is right across from the hotel. This is the very Mexican restaurant Don Pablo. Though you just have to have dinner during weekdays as it is open at 5 because it is a both bar and restaurant, you can have lunch on the weekend as it is open at 12 on weekends. It is rather small but it looks comfortable and has the vibe of Mexico inside. This is nacho served for free before meals and it is very large. It comes out with salsa sauce and sour cream. There are so many foods on the menu that I ordered well at once. I ordered three tacos, a quesadilla, and a cerdo mancheco, three kinds. Isn't this nacho so big? If I eat unsalty crepes nacho with fresh and sour salsa sauce, I can eat it and the little. In Mexico, yurina sauce ga maisu so. It is eaten dipped in salsa sauce and sour cream together, it's much tastier. Now, tacos have been served. I ordered two beef ones and one chicken one. Having taco with hot sauce sprinkled is the best way for me for a refreshing and spicy taste. There are beef with tomato salsa sauce, vegetables, lots of mozzarella and cheddar cheese, and sour cream on top. Taco is delicious, but it's a little hard to eat clean. It's pretty big. Now, quesadilla has come out. It has come out in four pieces with tomato salsa sauce and sour cream. They are quite large too. Sour domachico has come out too. Mexican Now, I will taste quesadilla, bring tomato salsa sauce on it. Mm -hmm. 
Quesadilla tastes a warm pizza as it has lots of beef and cheese. Eating it with tomato salsa sauce is much better. It was the most delicious of three. This is free offer. This is a dessert, honeymoon nacho, and is offered free when we join their event of posting pictures of having food here. Eating the crust flavored with honey with fresh cream on it is much better than eating ice cream. Its price on the menu is 7,501, and be sure to get this by joining the event of posting pictures. There is a famous franchise cafe known as Solving on the second floor in the same building. So I went there to have snow ice after a long time. The seasonal fruit is strawberry, so I ordered a snow ice with fresh strawberries and an ginger meat toast, glutinous rice cake bread toast. It's pretty, and considering there are lots of strawberries on it, its price is quite good. Besides, it's big enough for three to have. The cold, soft white snow ice with refreshing and sweet strawberries is not only harmonized in colors, but also perfect in taste. After I have eaten some of it, I can see some sweet boiled red bean inside. Red bean is a necessary ingredient in snow ice. Ginger meat toast, glutinous rice cake bread toast is crisp and chewy and so savory because of the powder on the surface. I'd like to try every snow ice as a dessert one by one here. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, and comment.